السلام عليكم وعليكم السلام ورحمة الله your name uh, Nayar Kazmi Nayar Kazmi and Nayar you've come from where East London East London local Imam Barga Muslim community of Essex Muslim community of Essex what does this moment mean to you just describe for us the preparation the thoughts the emotions that go leading into this moment um, well I've been writing poetry for about three years now I usually write to melodies for other reciters, for myself as well sometimes when I recite. But recently I, um, I see myself more as a poet than a reciter, so I wanted to give spoken word a go and um, see where that takes me, which is why I'm here. Um, I did actually write this this morning at 2 a.m. Subhanallah. So, um, let's see how this goes, inshallah. So, so you're um, a procrastinator by trade or? Yeah, I work, I work yeah. well under pressure. So um, <laughs> yeah, 2 a.m., let's see how this goes. I'm up for a challenge. Yeah, All right, cool. So, uh, who have you written for before? You said you write melodies for. Well, that depends on how good the audition goes. I don't mind giving names. No, I think you just said in your intro. You, oh, yeah, I write, I write for the reciters. For yeah, who like, have you um, written for so far? Mullah Rashid Haidar. Oh, Haidan, Subhanallah. Sayyid Ali Al Hakim. Shannon Rizwan, actually. Oh, Subhanallah. Uh, Subhanallah. Uh, so, you boy's family. Yeah. Yeah, I wrote yeah. for. Mary Mudaffar as well. We've wow. got an upcoming track in Ramadan. So, inshallah, uh, inshallah. Brilliant introduction. Let's hear you, everyone, welcome him with a round of applause. Do you think it's important to have projects like this? Very important. Um, as we saw from last year, there's hidden talents who we didn't even think of or even know of um, who came to the light. And um, so, yeah, I think it is a, I think it's a very important project. Even those who didn't make it to the final, who probably went out through the semis, I've seen them being invited to places as well. So it is a platform, very successful platform. It allows the youth to have a platform out there, which they may not have in their mosques. Oh, Habib of Allah, I have a story to tell about a fire that did damage even worse than hell. Oh, Habib of Allah, I have a story to tell about a fire that did damage even worse than hell. A fire that set your entire ummah ablaze. How they glorify the killers and even sing their praise. Oh, Habib of Allah, let's start after your death. How they threw away a gem and settled with less. Where innovation became rife and your ummah deprived of the sunnah they claimed that came from your life. So Zahra would stumble from door to door. As she reminds them of your sunnah, she tried to restore. But shaitan had his hooks deep inside them clawed and gave them a flame from the darkest pits of his soul. So Zahra would stumble from door to door. As she reminds them of your sunnah, she tried to restore. But shaitan had his hooks deep inside them he clawed and gave them a flame from the darkest pits of his soul. The next segment is the door. The door said to its hinge, you know what's next, brace yourself and let Allah attest for what, it, for what is to come next. Then the door set to light and the killers confess, they don't care who's inside, not even the princess. The hinge cries out to the baby inside, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, the hinge cries out to the baby inside, I'm sorry. I can't push back as they push from all sides. I can't push back as they push back from all sides. And at that moment, the baby replies, Mother, tell me. Mother, tell me. Why does your womb squeeze? Why can I no longer breathe? Mother, tell me. Why does your womb squeeze? Why can I no longer breathe? Ali looks on at the attack in disbelief, at the fire that was ignited by a lying thief. Ali looks on at the attack in disbelief, at a fire that was ignited by a lying thief. Now imagine he cries to his beloved. Now imagine Ali cries to his beloved. They sliced your wings when they broke your rib. Unlike Fitrus, Hussein couldn't fix your wings. Now imagine he cries to his beloved. They sliced your wings when they broke your rib. Unlike Fitrus, Hussein couldn't fix your wings. Then Ali says, now I wait for Israel to knock on our door. By taking, our, by taking your soul, he takes my soul. Now I wait for Israel to knock on the door. 
by taking your soul, he takes my soul, now my heart has been splintered, it shall never be whole, I pray for death to come and take me home, now I wait for Israel to knock on the door, by taking your soul, he takes my soul, now my heart has splintered, it, it will never be whole, I pray for death to come and take me home. Oh, Habib of Allah, did I cause your grave to shake? Forgive me. Did I cause Muhsin to wake? Oh, Habib of Allah, did I cause your grave to shake? Forgive me. Did I cause Muhsin to wake? He joined you so early, no body to bury. He joined you so early, no body to bury. Oh, Habib of Allah, did I cause your grave to shake? Forgive me. Did I cause Muhsin to wake? He joined you so early, no body to bury. Oh, Habib of Allah, when you go to her grave, O oh Habib of Allah, when you go to her grave, do you see my Imam who mourns in pain? Alone, his Shia he craves at her unmarked grave. The cold that burnt his mother's door still burns through his veins. The cold that burnt his mother's door still burns through his veins. His cheek bleed from the slap as he tries to take her pain. The cold that burnt his mother's door still burns through his veins. He his cheeks bleed from the slap as he tries to take her pain. Allow me to mourn with him to console his forsaken pain. Our oh, Habib of Allah, allow me to mourn with him to console his forsaken pain. Sallu ala Muhammad wa ali Muhammad. How do you think your performance went? I think it went well, much better than I thought it would, and um, I think I've impressed the judges. So let's see what happens next. Uh, Said Amar. Well, I suppose you could see from the reaction of the crowd that everyone is definitely feeling emotional about the words, and there was a lot of emotion uh, within that poem. And for someone to have written it at 2 a.m. is, you know, it's quite brilliant to tell you the truth. It's a great skill. Uh, there were certain lines where I found the analogies were very interesting. Fotros, the wings, Hussein can't even repair those. That, that was a lovely connection there. There was a line from the Nehj, from the sermon of, uh, known as the sermon, of course, the Shakshaqiya sermon, where you, you talked about what happened to the religion of Islam after the passing away. And I would have loved to have seen a bit more of that. To take poems on a deeper level, even lectures on a deeper level, is variety of sources. So you're a poet, but let's see a few more sermons where you take or you extract information and you place it within the poetry. Sometimes with the pronunciation, I think it will be vital for you. Is it Israel? Is it Israel? Who were you referring to? Because remember, Israel may be a tribe. Israel might be referring to an angel. Israel. Do you yeah, see what I'm saying? Yeah, no, I the Ain versus the Alif. That, that type of thing, I think for a poet, is going to be vital for you. That pronunciation. Because you want to show command of language. Poetry is about command of language in reality. And that's what I would love to see more of. But oratory, your passion, all of that delivery uh, really bodes well for your future. So well done, Nayar. Fantastic, fantastic well done. performance. Well done. Mullah Nazar. MashaAllah, Habibi Nayar Kadhmi, I didn't write any comment. Wallahi. Um, I wish um, if you didn't finish uh, your performance, you continue reciting. Very beautiful. You have a gift, Habibi. You know what? You are the gift. Thank you. And I thank you to come to Shia Voice to be the Shia Voice gift to the community. Say it, Mason. Really, really well said well recited. You chose a topic close to my heart. Um, Nayar, are you Pakistani? Yeah, Pakistani. I'm so glad you chose English poetry and not Urdu poetry because we have so much over there. But we need someone to fill this void and we need you. I'm, I'm Not only am I glad that you're on this show, but you're writing for everyone behind the scenes. And we need you to come in front of the screen now. We need everyone to know who you are, inshallah. And I hope to see you not only go to the next round, but go beyond the skies, beyond the stars, inshallah. Inshallah. Sayyid Jalal, lastly. Sayyid Nayar Kadhmi. Uh, so here as well, your name Sayyid is not written. But Sayyid, you have done a good job, beautifully. Many um, comments, uh, our judges, they mentioned. But the point I'm going to mention to you, when 
a poet is going to recite or read something, of course, this is very important because the topic is very emotional. So you, as a reciter, as a reader, you have to control your emotion. The speed of your reading was very fast. That was the reason we want a bit of uh, actually digestive time for us to digest the wordings. You get me? Um, overall, it was beautiful. The acting you did, like the slap one, was really beautiful. Um, you mentioned about the melodies. Do you know the melodies when you compose the melodies? How do you compose? So I, I mean, I don't compose melodies. I write two melodies. Okay, good, 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 good. Overall, overall beautiful. I really enjoyed and I wish all the best for you because you have done not just poetry, you have done Rausa, everything you have done. Thank you. Ahsan. Guys, put it up for Sayyid Nayar Kazmi. Ahsan. You were a bit worried beforehand. You were thinking, how's my audition gonna go? But as you can see from the reaction of the crowd, from the reaction of the judges, you absolutely smashed it. How are you feeling? And uh, if you do proceed into the next round, what are you gonna do differently? Um, well, that went much better than I thought it would. And um, I know I had some issues with speeding. I know I do have that issue, so I think that's something that I need to work on. And my pronunciation as well, maybe spend a bit more time practicing. Because leaving it on the day like I did today, that's not an um, ideal situation. It's not ideal, but yeah. definitely shows how talented you are, Sayyid. Yeah, MashaAllah, yeah. amazing, amazing, amazing. Best of luck, inshallah. Thank you.